Um, morning. Hello, welcome to my channel. It's I don't really know what day it is. It's Wednesday mm -hmm. and Ash was just dancing to a song in the gym. It's like mid-morning in between clients in the gym and they're going to get a bagel and then I'm going to train and then later on today um later on today we're going to an event um with the network marketing company and I feel like I've mentioned this a few times but I'll sort of explain a little bit more about the business today so breakfast To keep it nice and clean, not freak out and cause a scene. I try to hold it together, keep it together. Not sure who I really am, just be cute and super bland. I try to hold it together, keep it together. Been playing it down, but I'm so getting tired. Now won't you meet? done but I am so unproductive. No that's not true. I've started writing lists and stuff which helps me so much and then I'll be productive. Ooh, it's Tuesday and I think I'm gonna deadlift later. I haven't really decided. I've sat here for like nearly three hours which is a really long time. But I've done like maybe an hour and a half of recruiting so that's really good and I posted on Instagram and then later on when I got home I'm gonna do some content creation so it's fun um, I'm getting into it now and I have to go and do a client and then I'm gonna train I just drank all of the broth this is such random information I'm so sorry I drank all the broth from my ramen thing and I feel like I got it all in my teeth 
It's very fresh at home, so I feel better, which is good. That's, this is so close. Ugh. I've had enough of this, oh. Our timeline's getting worn out when we're going back and forth. You know we're only pretending. Welcome back to another workout voiceover. I've just been really enjoying these recently. So after I did my Romanian deadlifts as a warm up and some light sumos, I did three sets of 12. Um, and I love hate doing deadlifts for like 12 reps because it is just so bloody tiring. But I feel like it's really good, it gets my whole body really fired up deadlifts are just the best and then I decided to do a whole body workout and then since this workout I've pretty much done a whole body every single time because I just find that this is so so efficient and because um I'm doing upper lower supersets so I'm still doing quite a lot of glute focused work but then getting my up upper body stuff in that I sometimes kind of avoid or just don't do as much as I do my lower body I found that, I don't know, it was really efficient and effective. Um, doing the upper lower supersets means that you are doing something called blood shunting, which basically means your body works really hard to get the blood from one area of the body into the next area. So you sweat more and you work harder. And I just really enjoyed it. I'll make sure the whole workout is down below, but I started with chest press superset with a single leg bridge. My chest press, I had to go heavier than I sort of normally would want to because the 14s and the 16s were being used. And we've got two sets of each and they were both being used. I didn't want to drop down to 12 so I went up to 18 and it was really tough but I managed it so it was good. It's great to, it's great to be like forced to go heavier because sometimes otherwise you're like too scared. Um, but yeah, it was really good. So after I did... Um, my chest press and my bridges I did a single arm row and a lunge to step up and it was just so good and so sweaty um with the step ups I did my first few I think I did eight on each side with a barbell and then I did eight on each side body weight mainly because I was using a bench rather than a step and my ankles just felt really unstable and I felt like my calves and ankles were doing more work, I wasn't able to focus on my glutes, so then when I went body weight instead, I could feel, I could focus on activating my glutes a lot more and feel them, so don't be afraid to drop the weight, as much as I'm like, yes, it's amazing to go really heavy, like if you're not feeling it in the right place, then you do just need to drop the weights. So it's the next day, and I'm annoyed that I didn't actually film in the evening, um, because we had a good dinner but um, on the way home I called Ash to see what we wanted to put in and went to Tesco because I need direction um, and he said any meat that's on offer and I think sweet potato I ended up going in Sainsbury's and then a Tesco and then another Sainsbury's and I got like two packets of sausages that were reduced a packet of chicken a packet of cheese and bacon potato skins Broccoli, sweet potato. And I feel like there's something else random that went in the freezer. So I just can't be trusted. Oh, and then also I got five minutes from work and then realised I didn't have my cool bag and my lunch boxes, so I had to go back and get it and I was just annoyed. And that's why I didn't film. But for dinner, oh, that's the other thing I bought was noodles because they were on offer. We had like a sausage stir fry with peppers in it and that was really, really nice. And then we may or may not have had the potato skins as well, but it was good. And yes, now I'm drinking a monster and probably gonna do another whole body workout today as well, because I quite enjoyed it. I don't know, it was different. I never normally do that, so that's the plan. I wanna get to your clothes, gotta get it right now. I wanna push all the limits with you right now So watch your feelings, the city screaming when I'm coming home tonight We're living quick in the world, gotta get it right now People talk and tell what you wanna hear now But they all disappear, they will let you down so We better stick together, let's come whatever when I'm coming home tonight We're living quick in the world, gotta get it right
should be together It's heavy weather, we're heading for tonight You better take what you can cause the time is right now We only need the two of us I have just got home from work and I am so happy So it's quarter to eight actually I haven't just got home, I had a shower, a quick shower. Um, what am I saying? So I didn't do another whole body workout. I was so tired, like I was so checked out. I had one session left, had a bit of a headache. I just could not be bothered. I went into the changing rooms, which was lucky that I even went into changing rooms to get changed into like workout clothes, honestly. And I must have spent half an hour in there just talking to members. And then I was like, you know what, I'm just gonna stretch. And it was so good. I'm glad I just did something and I felt better afterwards. I'm really at, at, like kind of tight from my other whole body session because I guess I'm not used to doing sessions like that because I always do split. But like it was good, so definitely mix it up because you get achy. But two, like just be okay if all you do is do mobility because it is helpful. Um, I've still done, if you care, bear with. Even though I didn't do any sessions. Oh, hang tight, we're cleaning things up. No, I don't want the Fitbit Charge 3. My arm is getting tired. So I've done 11,000 steps today, which is good. That's not true, my thing buzzed. I thought I hit 12,000, I thought I'd hit my goal. I set my goal as 12,000. Oh, that's really not fair. Well, anyway, even though, oh, there you go. <laughs> Look, this doesn't make sense. 16,933, perfect. Stood for 12 or 12 hours. I only had five hours sleep last night. That's probably why. Um, yeah, I've lost 2.2 .2 kilos since the 7th of August. Amazing. Um, sorry, that's Fitbit. I'm obsessed with apps and stuff. I am going to have dinner. So, the other reason I think I was so tired is because I, me and Ash just didn't cook pasta last night. Sorry if I've already said this today. I don't know what I've said. We didn't cook pasta last night. So, my meals are spinach, peppers and chicken. That is it. So, I had one meal, like one veg and chicken meal and a bagel. Uh, mid morning and then just before my last session I had a yogurt a pack of snacker jacks and something else so it's just been like a weird food day um, I'm gonna eat that chicken and veg with this pot of pasta now which will bring I mean I've already kind of bought it left just because I'm at home and I'm happy but, yeah. See you in my next one, and until then, stay happy and healthy. Bye!